Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Kayla. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I have my pocket bags with me because I am going to be mixing scents together today. You guys actually requested this video like crazy. Um, a lot of you say that you want me to do more with my pocket bags and you think it would be cool if I would like mix different ones together and see what they smell like. So I thought that sounded like a really fun idea. So pretty much, I am just going to be combining different pocket back scents together and we are going to see if it's a good combination or a bad combination or in the middle or maybe it'll be like amazing or downright disgusting like I'm gonna throw up I don't know we are just going to have to see but without further ado I'm just going to get right into this video and I hope that you guys will enjoy watching oh yeah and before I forget since today's video is pocketback themed and we're going to be doing lots of sniffing okay that was really creepy but I want to see if you guys can subscribe and like this video using only your nose. You can't use your hands, you can only use your schnoz. Okay. Oh, I'm so cringy. You can only use your nose. And you only have five seconds to do it. Are you guys up for the challenge? Here we go. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Ah! Comment below if you successfully did that. Okay guys, so for this first pocket back mix, I'm thinking it's going to be a really good one because I put aside five of my favorite pocket back scents and we're going to be mixing them together and we're going to see if this is going to be a good combination or a bad combination. I can't see it being bad though because these are my favorites, but we will see how they mix. So you're going to be starting off with Brewberry. So I'm just going to be putting like a very, very little bit in there, but then we have fresh picked cherries and girl, OMG. This smells like Shirley Temple's. It's the best thing ever. Now we have Gumball, and this smells exactly like the name. It makes me crave bubblegum. In fact, it actually just made my mouth water so much that I had to pause a second to swallow my saliva. Anyway, TMI, let's continue on with Swingin' Vanilla. This one has a little monkey on it and it does not smell like vanilla. It actually smells like bananas and I love, love, love banana scents. So we're gonna put a little splash of that in there. And the last one we are going to be pouring in is this one and it's called Autumn Owl Cranberry Apple. And the smell of this reminds me of Disney. I love it so, so, so much. So we're gonna be putting some of that in there. And now I am going to rub it together. And let's see, do you guys think it's going to be good or bad? Comment below, I'm, I'm really excited. Okay, here we go. Ooh, oh my gosh. Wow, that scent is like really hard to explain. You know what this smell reminds me of? It reminds me of the orange, yellow, and green fruit by the foot fruit roll-ups. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? I think that one's like tropical scented. Oh my gosh. It smells like really fruity candy and it's like amazing. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna give it two thumbs up. Okay, so I just got myself a new little container because I'm going to be doing another pocket back mix that I'm kind of scared about. I'm going to be combining five of my least favorite pocket backs like uh, I am not looking forward to this one because I really cannot stand any of these scents like they are just not my cup of tea okay first I'm going to be putting the sugared vanilla wish on here and this literally okay like don't let the pretty packaging fool you in my opinion it smells like milk just like milk and super duper duper sweet vanilla to the point where it could like give you a headache okay so ew there's a drop of that now i'm going to be using this one called touchdown citrus blitz this one is really really old and let me let me tell you what it smells like it honestly smells like a big old hairy man that just put on a bunch of cologne and he's trying to cover up his stink that was an interesting way of describing it i know but that's what it smells like a drop of that now we're going to be using mahogany teak wood this was a Christmas one, and I hate this one. It honestly smells just like really, really strong cologne. That's all I'm getting from it. I just really, really dislike this one. Oh, okay, this one has been my least favorite since it came out. It's called A Walk in the Woods, and let me try to tell you what it smells like. I can't even describe it. It smells like dirt, leaves, and... Again, very strong cologne. I do not enjoy 
hand sanitizers that smell like men's cologne. Like, I just don't. So the last one that I'm going to be using is Mr. Raccoon Morning Stroll. And this isn't like the worst of the worst, but it just doesn't smell good. It just smells like some type of cleaning product. I don't know, I don't like it personally, so I've been putting a little bit on there. Ew. Now I'm going to be mixing this and, oh, I don't even want to put it on. Oh gosh. Here we go. Oh, I'm already starting to smell it. Oh my gosh. That scent could honestly give me a headache. That pocket bat combo literally smells like every kind of old lady perfume and every cologne you could possibly imagine all mixed together. It's just very strong and very unpleasant. So I would give that pocket bat mix one giant thumbs down. It was disgusting. All right, so for my next pocket back mix, I'm going to be combining five different holiday pocket backs, and these are all Christmassy and fun, and I really like the way these smell individually, but will they all smell good together? I don't know, we will see. Maybe this will smell like a winter wonderland. First, I'm gonna be using Frosted Snowman. Now I will be using Fresh Sparkling Snow. Mm, those two smell really good together. Now we have Twisted Peppermint, and I love this one. Okay, now we have Merry Cookie, and this one smells just like sugar cookies. I'm obsessed with it. The last one is Mistletoe Kiss. So we have a little bit of everything. Ooh, that's like really pretty looking. I'm hoping that this is gonna be good. I have, I have high hopes for this one, so here we go. Woo! Oh my gosh. Okay, just smelling that made me so happy. That is honestly better than the first combo that I did. It literally smells exactly like Christmas. You could smell the peppermint for sure. You could smell sugar cookies. And then also, surprisingly, this mistletoe kiss pocket back really just tied everything together and it kind of gave it like a little bit of a Christmas tree vibe, if that makes sense. I don't know. It just smells so good. And I'm gonna give that pocket back combo two big thumbs up. That was amazing. All right, guys, so for my last pocket back mix, I'm going to be choosing five random scents from my collection. And we are going to see if it was a win or a fail. So, here is the first one. Here is the second one. Here is the third one. Here is the fourth one. And this is gonna be the fifth one. So, now let's see which ones I ended up picking out. Ooh, okay, so first we have Blueberry Pancake, and I love this one. It's one of my favorites. Then we have pumpkin caramel latte so already that's gonna be very interesting blueberry pancake and pumpkin caramel latte like I don't know how those are gonna mix but then we have liquid sunshine and this is like a lemonade scent we have cool summer splash and then lastly frosted snowberry so that's a very interesting combination there we have some like bakery scents but then we also have fruity scents it's going to be interesting so i am just going to be putting these directly onto my hands so first we have blueberry pancake now i'm going to be putting on pumpkin caramel latte so oh i don't know how well those are gonna mix now we're gonna be doing frosted snowberry this is cool summer splash i love this one. Oh my gosh it's so good and lastly we will be doing liquid sunshine all right so now it is time to rub our hands together and i'm about to take a big whiff do you guys think it's going to be really good, really bad, or in between? Comment below, but here we go. Ooh! Oh my gosh. So honestly, I couldn't even tell that the pumpkin caramel latte was on my hands. I was worried that that one would throw everything off, but honestly, it smells like really fresh cucumbers, and I don't know, it smells kind of fruity as well. It's like really really refreshing i think i'm gonna give that pocket back combo two thumbs up i didn't think it was gonna be that good but it was honestly amazing all right guys so that was all for today's video of me mixing my pocket backs together i hope that you enjoyed watching definitely give this video a big thumbs up with your nose if you liked it and i want you guys to leave a comment down below and let me know 
what is your favorite pocket pack and what is your least favorite pocket pack. I would love to hear from you, so make sure you let me know. But I love you guys so much, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!